families rebuild their lives. She is 10-year-old Rachel Wheeler of Lighthouse Point, and she joins us now. Rachel, welcome. Thank you. Also joining us is Angel Eloma, Executive Director for South Florida-based nonprofit Food for the Poor, and he's calling us from Haiti. Mr. Eloma, thank you for joining us. My pleasure. Now, Rachel, what is it exactly you're doing for Haiti? I am building homes in Haiti with Food for the Poor. You started your fundraising effort all the way last year, right after the devastating floods of 2008. Now, how, what, is your, what is your goal? How many homes do you want to build in Haiti? I want to build a total of 25 homes in Haiti. And Rachel, where exactly are the homes going to be situated? Do you know? Yes, they are going to be built in Leogon, Haiti. Leogon. How far away from Port-au-Prince is Leogon? It's, my mom says it's about a two-hour drive. Leogan is one of those areas that got really devastated, and uh, um, since Port-au-Prince is still under rubble and we can't build there, we're trying to build in the other areas that suffer tremendously. Yes, and certainly all the devastation not limited to Port-au-Prince alone. It was very widespread. Rachel, why was it so important for you when you heard about what was going on to do this, to raise the funds and to build these homes? I think it's so important because they have nothing, nothing at all. I imagine your parents are proud. This was your own idea, I'm assuming. Yep, it was my own idea. When do you, have you already been to Haiti? When do you get to go and see what's going well, on? I really want to go to Haiti, but I want to go when my village is finished. We have already gotten land and we have started building 10 of the homes already. So it's already in process. Okay. And Rachel, should people want to contribute more to your effort, what can they do? Where can they go? They can go online to my website at www.foodforthepoor.org forward slash Rachel. Rachel Wheeler, she's a 10-year-old from Lighthouse Point. Angel Aloma, Executive Director for South Florida-based nonprofit Food for the Poor. Thank you both. Thank you.